Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to discuss all the questions which are asked in Cognition Technical Assessment on 30th of September. In cluster 2, there are total 14 questions are asked which belong to three different sections. Cluster 2 includes three different sections. Section 1 Coding in Python. Section 2 Query Database using Answer SQL and MySQL. And section 3 is the cloud fundamental in which there are multiple choice questions are asked. In first section of SQL, there are two query questions are asked, while in section 2, Python programming, there are two coding questions are asked. In section 3, cloud fundamentals, there are 10 MCQs we have two choice. Section 1 SQL query. In this section, there are two questions are asked. The total time allocated for this section is 35 minutes. We have to write query for the both the question in 35 minutes. This is the first question asked in SQL query section. The question says that write a SQL query to display the employee ID, name, basic salary and net pay for the employees whose basic salary is greater than 5000. Your output should have four columns as given below. We can view the schema for this question. This is the schema provided by the question. We have to use name which, is, which are given in the schema as it is in the query. We can view schema by this section by clicking this section view schema. Our output will, should be shown in output section. We have to write the query in query section. This is the sample solution for first coding question. If you face any issue, you can comment in comment section. I will give an answer. This is the second question asked in SQL query section. The question says that write a SQL query to display the title, price and ISBN of book that were published after January 1, 1940 and that fall under the C102 category. Our output should have three columns as given below, title, price and ISBN. They pro in exam, they provided you the schema, but unfortunately for this question, I don't have the schema. This is the sample answer for second question asked in SQL query. You can refer this answer. Select title, price, comma ISBN from books where published date is greater than the date which is given by us and category equal to C102. Here books is a table name. Section 2 Python programming coding. In this section, there the total question asked are 2 and total time allocated for this section is 1 hour 10 minute. We have to write code for both the question in 1 hour 10 minute. This is the first question asked in second section Python programming. You can pause the video and read the whole question and try to attempt by your own. You can refer this solution for the first coding question. This is the second question asked in Python programming section. You can pause the video and read the whole question and try to attempt it by your own. In Cognition Technical Assessment, we have to implement only function for a question which is given below. We do not have to write code from scratch. This is the sample answer for second coding question. You can refer this answer. The last section in cluster 2 of Cognition Technical Assessment is Cloud Fundamental. In this section, there are 10 multiple choice questions are asked. The total time allocated for this section is 15 minutes. Question 1. Which cloud computing service model is responsible for managing the underlying operating system, runtime environment and middleware, infrastructure as a service, function as a service, Platform as a service, software as a service. The correct answer for this question is platform as a service. Option number C. 
Next question is which cloud deployment model involves a single organization utilizing resources from multiple cloud providers? Option given are private cloud, hybrid cloud, community cloud, and public cloud. The answer for this question is hybrid cloud. You can refer this explanation. Next question is company requires event driven execution of backend service. What cloud service fit bits? The options are load balance, virtual machine, object storage, and serverless function. The correct answer for this question is serverless function. You can read explanation here. Next question is how does a community cloud differ from a private cloud? The option given are it allows share infrastructure between users. Option B, it is shared among similar organization. Option C, it is open to all public user. Or option D, it is for a specific organization. The correct answer for this question is it is shared among similar organization. Next question is which cloud deployment model involves a single organization utilizing resources from multiple cloud providers? The options are private cloud, hybrid cloud, community cloud, or public cloud. The correct answer is hybrid cloud. Next question is what is the purpose of containerization in cloud virtualization? Option A to improve performance in virtualized environments. Option B to provide isolated and lightweight runtime environment for application. Option C to manage and allocate hardware resources to virtual machine. Option D to provide secure runtime environment for application. The correct answer for this question is to provide isolated and lightweight runtime environment for application. Next question is a company wants to ensure data privacy and compliance with industry regulations. Which model should they choose? The options are private cloud, hybrid cloud, community cloud, and public cloud. The correct answer is private cloud. You can read the explanation. Next question is which virtualization method is commonly used in cloud environments? Options are full virtualization, option B hardware virtualization, option C container based virtualization or option D para virtualization. The correct answer for this question is container based virtualization. Next question is a company is comparing cloud providers based on their responsibility model which aspect should they review the options are data encryption resource scalability network security and service levels the option is the correct option is data encryption the next question is how does a community cloud differ from a private cloud the option given are it allows share infrastructure between users option b it is shared among similar organization. Option C, it is open to all public users. Or option D, it is used for a specific organization. The correct answer for this question is it allows share infrastructure between users. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share, and subscribe.